Hey, this is Andrew from GameTestPlay.com, and today, I'll be playing Crazy Climber 2. Crazy Climber 2 was developed by Nichibutsu, published in 1988, eight years after the original Crazy Climber. It's now available on Hamster's Arcade Archive series for the PS4. The object of the game is to climb to the top of the building and grab hold of a helicopter. There are lots and lots of hazards in this game. Closing windows, people dropping vacuum cleaners and musical instruments, scaffolding, roller coasters, gorillas, and more. The gameplay is brutal, and will no doubt take you several attempts to reach the top of the first building. The controls in Crazy Climber 2 are make or break for some people. The game uses twin sticks that act as arms of the climber. You must shift both the left and right analog stick back and forth in alternating directions. I imagine this makes more sense with joysticks on the original cabinet, but it still works on the PS4 controller. It took me about 15 minutes to get a handle on the controls, and I venture to bet that most people would not put this kind of time into getting proficient. The game looks alright, and I can distinguish pretty much everything that's going on. Although the windows closing sometimes throws me off. Also, level 5 looks pretty ugly. Speaking of which, there are six different buildings to climb, all with different layouts, backgrounds, and even theme music when you get to the top. I never figured out how to get past the windmills on level 3 without getting knocked off. If you die, you continue where you left off until you lose all your lives. Overall, there is quite a bit of fun to be had with Crazy Climber 2, for those who are determined enough to take on its ambitious controls, and unforgiving difficulty. That's it for now. If you want more retro reviews, check out the website at GameTestPlay.com.